Wow, this is truly a sight to behold. Welcome to graduation 2020 style. Um, before I start my speech, I just want to acknowledge the work of the Chamber Strings and the Year 12 students that have spent time together in Chamber Strings since they were in Year 3, and that's something very special. And since they did their performance for a small group of their own parents and families uh, maybe three weeks ago, I've just been in love with Waltz Number 2, and um, it was just played so beautifully and such a fitting finish. And I'm so pleased that as the Year 12 students, you got to perform for a much larger audience um, this year. I'd also like to tw thank 12E and 12I for busting out Rick Astley and AHA, because for us oldies in the room, that was a really nice start to the evening. So thank you to those two classes. We really appreciate it. Good evening, everyone. Welcome. It is certainly a different style of graduation. Um, and I would like to welcome you all. Councillor Herman Vorster, PNC President Colin Frew, Varsity College staff, parents and families, and most importantly, our graduating students of 2020. I would like to begin by thanking you all for being here this evening. I think we were all a little afraid at some stage through this year that this night would not actually happen in the way it has. So I truly, from the bottom of my heart, am so pleased that we all get to experience this important and watershed moment with our students, with your children. I love these occasions and these are the events that at the end of the year usually re they really do re-energise us because we are really working hard to make sure that we finish the year but we have to stop and really take account of these very special times. And at the end of the year when the edges start to get a little bit frayed, these are the wonderful moments that we absolutely enjoy. I'm sure you would all agree with me that the edges this year are a little more frayed at home learning. I'll get to that bit later. It has been a year like no other, but it is important that tonight we don't dwell too much on the bad, and I'm not going to do that. We have to celebrate what's wonderful, and seeing these lo lovely young men and women mature over the last two years has been a privilege for me and for the teachers, and it's an absolute joy to be here with you tonight. As a group, you are committed, you are creative, you are sportive, sporty, you are hardworking, you are also genuine and funny and a pleasure to be around. And we are certainly going to miss you at Varsity College. That being said, I'm sure that I would see parents and teachers no heads nodding in agreement when I say you can also be a little bit frustrating at times. And I know Ms. Ma Mr. Maines and Miss Innes would definitely agree with me. Tonight, students, is a special night for you, but it's also a time where we need to thank people and that's one of my jobs up here tonight. Firstly, to all of our families. Well, what can we say? Don't you all love that at-home learning? And this year, we do thank you for the work that you have done in supporting us to support your Year 12 students to achieve their success. You have been a major part of the success of your students this year, and we sincerely acknowledge and appreciate the work that you have all done to help out. Teachers at Varsity College, truly a dedicated group and I would say that the teachers of the year 12 students are the most dedicated that I've ever seen. I would like to ask all our students to join me in a round of applause acknowledging the hard work of your teachers. The relationships that are cultivated in the year 12 classrooms of Varsity are built on trust and respect students and staff trusting each other and respecting each other. It is something incredibly special to see. Thank you, teachers, for your care and compassion and for your perseverance and your persistence. I would also like to acknowledge the support and guidance that has been given by Mr Maines, Miss Innes and Mr Morgan. This year, they have guided you all every step of the way. They have been tough and demanding and I'm sure that you will all agree with me that the work that they have done has been invaluable to every single one of you and has certainly helped you get through the tough times of 2020. As you finish your final week of school, it is so important for you to remember the people that have gone through this experience with you, and that is your friends that you are sitting amongst this evening. It is your family 
that is here to support you. And it is all of the other people at Varsity College that are here tonight because they care about you and they care about your future. I hope that these connections remain strong for you. For all of you, this is a closing of a chapter. And normally I would say that with this closing, there is sadness, but I'm not sure that this is the case this year. I think we're all ready to kick 2020 squarely to the curb. But I know that you're all feeling a great deal of excitement that you are about to leave school and start the next chapter of your journey. So finally, on behalf of Varsity College staff and the community, please accept our congratulations on your graduation and our collective hopes that the opportunities you have had at Varsity College act as a strong foundation for daring to dream about a very big future. Congratulations, class of 2020.